GCMS is gas chromatography with mass spectrometry detector. This technique is normally used for quantitative and qualitative analysis. In this experiment, we will use GCMS for quantitative and qualitative analysis of alcohol mixtures. Objectives of today's experiment are including first, students know the principles and components of GCMS. Second, students know how to simply use the GCMS machine. Third, students know how to analyze the results from GCMS. And lastly, students can compare the utility case between GCMS and GCFID. Today's experiment is the analysis of three different alcohols, including ethanol, propanol, and butanol. Three of them are dissolved in methanol. Before we start, I would like to ask you, what is the concentration of each alcohol in the stock solution? You can find the answer in the video. Please carefully watch the video. This is an example of how to prepare an ethanol stock solution. After prepare a stock solution, now we will prepare a working solution. Again, I would like to ask you, what is the final concentration of each alcohol? So please carefully watch the video and you will find an answer. All three alcohols have been prepared in the same concentration.
After this, the alcohol has been pipetted into the GCMS YL and they are ready to be injected into the GCMS machine. Before injection, we need to connect the columns and set the GCMS parameter. And here is parameter that we will use today. After setting the parameters, we need to tune the GCMS and wait for it to be ready. Here is an example of how GCMS works. After the injection, we will get the chromatogram like this. For the analysis of result, we will discuss in the lab lesson. So, thank you for your attention and see you guys in the lab.